In just a few short weeks, these orange barricades will be removed. Harrison Street will be reopened, but it will look a little different. There will be new bicycle lanes up and down Harrison Street, making it more pedestrian friendly. It's the final puzzle piece connecting downtown Flint's Saginaw Street corridor with the new health complex over here at MSU and the Flint Farmers Market. From this to this. A year and a half after Genesee Towers came tumbling down, an urban plaza rising in its footprint. And you can come down here and literally see for yourself uh, with the improvements on the street. Improvements the Clady family has been waiting for. Just love the downtown environment. That environment getting greener thanks to a grant from the Mott Foundation. We have the funding in place to put in bike lanes and beautification and make it a great campus community corridor. It is becoming more walkable, more bikeable, and I think this is another step in that. So I've been uh, biking everywhere that I can for the past couple years, and it's just awesome to see how much easier it is getting. Vehicular traffic also still welcomed on Harrison Street, but Mayor Walling says the idea is to make downtown Flint more pedestrian friendly. We want our downtown to be a 24 hour live, work, play type environment. So we don't need four lanes of one way traffic. It'll bring more walkability down here, making it more yeah, bikeable, walkable. All those things are great. In Flint, Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News.